When I call your table number, I want you to come up, introduce yourself, name, school, if you're a mentor, your profession, we're always strategizing um, to help improve our situations or just to support each other. So find your intent. So you need to have at least one person uh, that you can have dreams like you or bigger dreams than you, like all of these women have said, that are gonna speak life into you and stop talking to people who just gossip. Don't even let it in. And there's so much energy out there that would help make you um, discount your capabilities and change your vision, have people tell you what you're capable of. It's happened to everybody at, at every turn. And you just need to, you know, get your group, get your get your people that are also motivated and, and ambitious and like drown, drown it out. So how you show up for class, how you show up for athletics, how you show up in your family, that's how you are. And so you want to build on that. Finished out at San Francisco State, but it was interesting because the second half of my college career was so much different than my first half. I was all about the classes and my second half. So I, but I fell into education. That was not my original plan. And now I am writing my first book. Okay, so tell us the day in the life of an Oakland PD. You start your shift, and then what happens? I get to work about 7 o'clock. Got to be in the chair by 7.15. Uh, we hit the field maybe about 8, 8.05 at the latest, and then we take calls for service. We do car stops. Me and her specifically are the most proactive in our squad. So What's proactive? Proactive is like we down and dirty. to go through like a program of construction depending on your trade because I'm in glass. They, we call us a glazer. Mm -hmm. um, but there's electrical, there's plumbing, there's different things. This is a five-year program. You start off as an apprentice, but once you and when you when you're at the apprentice level, you're actually paying into your pension. They say you're you're made up of the five closest people to you. So you get to choose those people. Every time you make a decision for something, you're saying yes to something, you're potentially saying no to something else. Make decisions consistent with your goals. So if somebody says, let's go to the capital party, you'd be like, I have a test, I'm on a scholarship, or I want to go to grad school. So make a decision consistent with your goals because there will be another party.